my god! Oh my god, we're on it! <laughs> hey guys, James from DJ Gaming back for another video. We're here with Virtual Towers Online once again. Uh, if you've seen my previous video on this, that was the very first build of this. We've had another update now. It's been a few months, possibly a year I'd say, since the last update. Wow, they've done a good job on this. I've been keeping an eye on their Facebook page and things like that, and I've been seeing the pictures, and it looks fantastic. Already, we've got a full new menu for a start. Obviously, all our options and things like that. Uh, there is going to be an online mode, which is going to be good. So we click straight into story mode and uh, let's start a new game okay so here we are the entrance to Alton Towers uh, I've been to Alton Towers a couple of times I know Dan we took Dan as well we'd never been there this is just incredible already obviously when we, when we first had the first update we started inside the park and we only had a couple of rides we could go on Oblivion and um, Smiler I think it was uh, but now they've done a hell of a lot of update on this now. So here's the uh, the map. Everything that's coloured in is what's been built. Everything that isn't still needs built. So it's going to be a full representation of Alton Towers, which is going to be incredible to look at. So so if we have a look here, we've got Oblivion, we've got Smiler, we've got X Sector, which is where Oblivion and Smiler is. Uh, we've got Hex, we've also got Spinball Wizard, which used to be a Sonic Spinball sort of roller coaster. Uh, Hex is just amazing. We've got the Wicker Man, which I can't wait to go on. Apparently Battle Galleons is on there as well, which is a great little um, great little ride, that is. So what we'll do is we'll, we'll have a wander around. Right, go through the turnstile. Beep. If I just go down here, because right... Oh! We've had a bit of a glitch. Oh, there we go. Bit of a frame buffer there. If I go down here, this is the exact spot where me and Dan actually took a selfie uh, in the pissing rain. Right, so, welcome to Virtual Towers Online. A couple of billboards there, available now. I don't think, I think, I'm just, I, think I missed all that. There was a uh, state of claiming game, uh, little blocks that you can get. Uh, if you pay a little bit of money, you can get uh, your name put on one of the blocks as you walk into the um, park. Uh, so yeah, so I'll just show you all the names, uh, which are down here somewhere. Yes, here we go. Right, so these are all the names. So these, a lot of YouTubers that have done it. Never know. I might put, get my name put down on that. Get DMJ game. Oh, it is. Sorry, it is. Oh my God. Oh my god, we're on it! <laughs> that must have been for the first time! Oh yes! Virtual Towers Online! Fucking look at that! I love it! Yes! We are on the Virtual Towers Online bit! Oh! We've got our own plaque, Dan! Look at that! <laughs> oh, thanks guys, I didn't even know you did that! Oh, that's class! Thank you so much! And these are all obviously people that have shown their support and things like that. Oh, I am so touched by that. Thank you guys so much for putting that on. <laughs> Sorry, that's taking me by surprise because I truly didn't know that was there. <laughs> right, so we'll just have a little bit of a run. And we'll have a wander down here. Here is Spimble Wizard. This is a hell of a ride. I wonder if we can ride it. Entrance. Can we ride it? Oh, I think we can. No, we can't. Damn you! Oh, duckies! Look how good that water looks. Smoking areas. Designated smoking areas. This is what the Alton Towers actually have. Everything is is modelled exactly how Alton Towers is. So if you've never been to Alton Towers, and like, say you can't get to Alton Towers, I different country, things like that, or during lockdown, um, I recommend having a look at this because this is going to give you the exact idea of what Alton Towers is like. 
Right, so obviously this is the X sector this way. And we have Oblivion and Smiler. Right, so where is the entrance to Oblivion? Here we go. Right. There is no smoking permitted in this queue. Just imagine standing here, having to go all this way for like a 10 second ride. How long is this queue? I didn't, re didn't realise it was this long. Here we go. Now I remember first ever time going on this ride. Um, I sat in the far far left hand corner of the front row and obviously it's got a 90 degree drop on this and you go into a tunnel. I swear to Christ I brushed that tunnel as I went through it. It shit me right up. The one ride I am looking forward to is, uh, well one I, I hope Hex is open, um, 13 and Rita. Can't wait for them to. Oh and obviously Air. I can't wait for that. I don't think it's called air anymore because it's got a virtual reality thing with it now. Oh. Don't look down. Oh shit, now! <laughs> got the smoke perfect. That's literally all Oblivion is. It's. It, all that cue for that. <laughs> oh, I can't actually get off until uh, until we get back. Yeah, all that queuing to go up, down 90 degrees, round a corner, over a bump, back at the station. Done. Right, so this is on your way to Hex. I mean, they just love that sound. We'll see what we can get on. But I think it is, at the moment, still only Oblivion and Smiler that we can ride. But there's, there's Hex. Now Hex is a very interesting ride. Um, I don't want to spoil it for everyone, anyone, for everyone, but it tells you a story about a guy uh, from Alton itself, and it gets really weird and freaky. Phone boxes. Right. I think if we follow it this way, this is the Galleon ride. Yes, it is. Now this ride is uh, really fun. So basically, you're on these little pirate ships which go around and you get to fire at um, obviously anyone who's all the other boats and things like that. But obviously as well, well these are, they're still not rendered properly, but people on that are standing around can fire water at you as well. You get absolutely soaked. You get more wet on that than you ever ever do on a uh, log flume or anything like that. Fucking glass. Absolutely brilliant. Great little fun ride that is. Here it is. Here it is. Wicker Man. Look at that. That looks so good. Oh wow. Can't wait to go on that. Who ever thought you could have a wooden roller coaster on fire? If you do want to see a video of um, the Wicker Man actually being ridden, I will put a link. Uh, well, Dan will put a link in the description below of uh, Virtual Towers Online's video. I think that's pretty much it at the moment. Still more than it was before. I mean, you can see that they've started rendering a lot of the uh, buildings and things like that. These are all going to be like the little, little arcade ones you get. I love how the fact that they've just got pallets and things like that about. Guys, you have done a fantastic job on this already. I know it's nowhere near being finished yet, but still, for you to put this put this out for people to, to have a look at for themselves, it, it's just great, really. So that was Virtual Towers Online. Absolutely fantastic job. I am still stumped by that. That has really got me. Uh, Virtual Towers Online. Can't wait for the next update. Obviously, it's going to take a little time, but for quality like this, you can't rush. Anyway, guys, thank you very much. We'll see you in the next video. Ta-da.
Hee <laughs> hee!